City Council reviewed Toledo's 2023 budget today, and now there's debate over how to use federal money. And that's what's causing some clashes inside of council chambers. Our Michael Sandlin caught all the action earlier today, joins us now live in the studio. So what is the big issue? Well, Jeff, Councilwoman Katie Maleen says in council chambers that the city's budget is too reliant on one-time only federal money. And once it's all gone, the city will have to make painful budget cuts. However, Deputy Mayor Abby Arnold and Commissioner of Budgets Melanie Campbell say the funds are being used as intended for improving the city, saying there's numerous benefits and they're too careful with the budget for drawbacks. This led to an exchange between Moline and Arnold inside council chambers. Here's an excerpt. We will continue to budget conservatively um, and we will continue to work throughout the year to reduce uh, those transfers and um, the dollars being used out of the um, fund balance as we have in every other year of this administration besides the uh, year of COVID. Okay, I, I, I feel that it's still just being ignored and it's just going to be that much more difficult. And it seems that the full impact of this will not happen until this administration is no longer in office. Keep in mind, the official 2023 budget won't be complete until April. However, Arnold said they don't intend to make any major amendments, but Moline has gone on record saying that she's willing to fight for changes. Reporting in studio, I'm Michael Sandler, WTOL 11.